Hi friends, welcome to Lesson. Today is the 24th episode in the history series. So today we are going to discuss about Christianity. So this is part three of Christianity. Yes. So in the last history episodes, we discussed about Christianity. There were part one and part two of Christianity. So Christianity has had a large history from the time of Jesus and his apostles to the present time. So this history is like sometimes it got banned, it got not banned. <laughs> Some there were other sex farming like that. Many things happened over its history from that time when Christianity was still a sect to the present day where it is a religion worldwide. <laughs> Yes, so it began in the first century AD as a Jewish sect, but not as a religion. So it was a sect of this Judaism. Yes, so but it quickly spread throughout the Greco-Roman region. Yes, so so this Christianity started in the area which presently known as Israel. So from this place. It, this religion spread over from the Greek to Roman religions. Yes, so that means the area which is like present in the Roman Empire. Yes, not exactly presently, presently, but was then in the Roman Empire. Yes, so although it was originally persecuted under the Roman Empire, it later became the state religion. So first it was persecuted. People were arrested who supported and were Christians. And yes, so they were put in jail and executed. That's just a lot of bad punishment for just adopting a religion. <laughs> yes. So, but under the king Constantine, this later became the state religion. So Christianity, once being a banned religion in the Roman Empire, became the state religion. <laughs> yes. So I think Roman was taken out. So it's just empire, Christian empire. <laughs> yes. Okay. So in the Middle Ages, it spread into Northern Europe when Russia. So it also spread into Northern Europe. So normally the Roman Empire is in the Southern Europe, but it also went up to Northern Europe and the areas which is now Russia. Yes, that means in the north, very north. During the age of exploration, it expanded throughout the world and is now the largest religion in the world because of these colonies made by the Europeans. So the Europeans were normally like Christians in those ages. So they went to those colonies and spread it to their areas. Yes, so for example, they colonized North America. So they just spread it all over North America. So they spread it, the religion which is Christianity. Yes. So next, the scriptures. So Christianity uses the Bible, which is a collection of many canonical books in two parts. So these parts are known as the Old Testament and the New Testament. Yes. So the Bible has been translated into over 600 languages. That is a lot of languages. 600. Yes. So next, a belief called Trinitarianism in Christianity. So the Bible mentions God the Father, God the Son and the Holy Spirit. But these are not separate things. So these three are forms of the one and only true God. Yes. So they were like forms. So this belief is called the Trinity. Yes. So today most Christian Christian denominations and churches believe this is belief, believe is belief, <laughs> called as Trinitarianism. Yes, so this is about Christianity part 3. So yeah, bye.